foolish mortals, we're back again on my trip to, what are we doing? Getting myself stronger? Pretty much. We're on our road to Viridian City, and I should have gone to the bathroom. I put two different decks in your hands of fake cards, and I'm making you climb a mountain and deliver milk. What? If, if you break the milk or drop any cards, you have to start at the bottom of the mountain again. Is this a Dragon Ball reference? Partially. <laughs> this smells like a Dragon Ball reference. I wish I knew what that smelled like. You don't want to know. It smells mostly like children's underwear. What does that smell like? Nasty. Depends on the children. So now we're trying to complete more reverse matches. This time we gotta do a dual destiny reverse. We're up against Kaiba with his new, newly incorporated god card and XYZ dragon cannon. And, and should I just use hot sauce? I would recommend using your personal decks, yes. Hot sauce too. I, I do not like Ishizu's deck. No one likes Ishizu's deck. She's not a winner for a reason. I win! Second to go, please. Please do. So, by the way, if you ever draw animations of this, please imagine <laughs> as a teeny tiny navvy. Why do I have to be annoying? I'm trying here. Fine, you're the Minish Cap. Why am I a talking bird hat? Fine, oh you're god. Going to oh god. What? Oh, oh thank god. god. I was worried he used the effect of Thunder Dragon to summon two more Thunder Dragons to his hand. Don't worry. If he if he had a polymerization, he could have summoned the twin headed Thunder Dragon. And that's a really good card. I activated Swords of Revealing Light. Are we okay with that? Okay, good. Um we could do Breaker. Um Uh let's summon Breaker? Because he has that special ability. Yeah, but we don't want to use it, because then he won't be strong enough to take on Vorse Raider. Uh, I could use Fire Kraken, and I could... He's not strong enough to defeat Vorse Raider. Vorse Raider has 1,800. Dust Tornado could help us. It would take care of his face down so next turn. Okay, setting that. My Tyrant Dragon is the only one that could take it on, but I don't have the ability to. Well, Bachi has 1,900. Well, is 1800, so we could use the Blazing and Pachi. Uh -huh. Summon it? So, uh, yeah, if it's Mirror Force, we don't want to lose our. Uh, <clears throat> yeah, that's probably our best bet. Summoning. No. I have a plan, but it involves me getting called to arms. Well, for right now, see if we can nuke his Force Raider. Uh, we can't. What do you mean we can't? 1900. Why can't I read the numbers? It's so fuzzy. Because I have it set on a low uh, resolution for you for the sake of recording. I guess. Okay, so again, 1900. 1850. Again, <sighs> thank God for Swords of Revealing Light. Yeah, okay. Don't worry, I have a small plan. And the small plan is being activated. No, it cannot because I do not have a spell or a trap card. Oh, you can use it. Oh, I can still use it's it. Just saying, it's just saying that if you use it, if you have the ability to, you can. I destroyed... What did I destroy? Silent Doom. Last. Okay. Hey, but little Apache. Little... My little cute little guy. And you doubted putting little Kaiman on your deck. I did, I will admit to that. Hey, little Chimera, how you doing, buddy? Little Chimera is shit on his own, but it gives you enough attack boost to take on Vorse Raider. Yeah. See? My battle plan planned work. It only worked because you got lucky and drew a Chimera. Actually, should I use? No, 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 don't use it. I mean, you could potentially destroy it, but if it's like a wall of illusion or something with defense, you're not getting anywhere. Depends why I skip my I, I can make the Okay, I have an idea. Why do I have UFO turtle in my deck? Because it's fire type. What to do? 
When this card is destroyed by a battle and sent to the graveyard, you can special summon one fire monster with 1,500 or less attack points from your deck. Oh. Which is where, uh, this is, that would play into Little Chimera. Yeah. It'll also but play are... into basically giving me fire. So here's two, th uh, so you can summon Breaker to have another attack monster with yeah. 1,900. Yeah. Or you could tribute summon to bring out your dragon guy now. But you risk the chance that if it's a wall of illusion, he goes back to your hand and you're defenseless. Yeah. I have an idea. What I'm gonna do... Is summon UF... Okay, no, that's one that has to be destroyed in battle for it in order to work. Yeah, but you could also destroy yourself in battle. Valid point. I have an idea. Okay, tell me if this idea it is stupid. No matter what, it's getting boosted. True. Okay, UFO turtle, it goes into the graveyard, I summon another little tiny fo fire fodder. I don't know if you have enough little chimeras in your deck. No, no, just any fire fodder, like, anything that's low enough so I can summon that thing. I'm gonna try to keep little chimera on my deck, on my field, so I can have an extra boost on Tyrant Dragon. Alright. Does that make sense? Yeah. Do you think it will work? No. Potentially. Depends on what Kaiba draws. I mean, what could Kaiba draw that will kill me? Polymerization. Fuck. Okay. Okay, good. We got rid of Lord of D. That's, that was not a good thing to have out. And I heard okay. You. Okay. Ending the phase. He got you there. Yeah, he did. I was hoping he would attack my turtle. So now we're now we're posed with the same problem, but without a shield. We can gamble with UFO Turtle. Yeah. Try and destroy his face down. Or we can say fuck it and bring out Tyrant, but risk running into Illusion. Yeah, that's the problem. I mean, Illusion, dra this one is 2,900. It is a big attack point. Yeah. But, if it's wall, but if it's Wall of Illusion, it just goes back to your hand anyway. Which is a problem. I got an idea. Run with the thing. I summon, let's just say for example, Fire Kraken. No, wait. Yes, put it in defense mode. And then hope to God he doesn't attack it. No, that's not going to work. Whoa, He'll... no, wait. If he goes for an attack, he's going to target Little Chimera. Because it has the lowest attack points. True. Okay. If I put and has got Kaiba's got a lot of cards that can take that Chimera down. Really, you think? No, um, I know. I know. Uh, I could summon Fire Kraken. What's his attack point value? Uh, 1600. Okay. With Chimera, that'll put him up to a nice. Uh, or, I can summon the Great Angus, which is 1800. And that'll put him over 20. Which would be useful for attacking. Anything. Right. And I'm going to attack the that card with, um,. UFO turtle, so if it gets destroyed, I can summon another thing to my deck, and I, I, I have an idea! Well, if it's lower, you're taking damage, nothing gets destroyed. I have an idea, and I'm hoping to God it works. I'm basically praying to whatever Jesus there is out there. Slash, we are stalling. Let's well, see what happens this turn. He, he just needs to hunt out with one. He just, don't Raigeki and we'll be fine. Doubt he, has he didn't do anything. Fucker didn't do anything? Nope. Okay. I'm gonna be a dick. I'm 
wondering if it's worth attacking him with Little Chimera first and then hurting him with the Tyrant Dragon. There really isn't. Okay, I'm trying to figure out which move is the bigger dick move. Well, you don't really have a any other those moves you could do. I'll just attack. If you attack with Chimera, you won't die. I'll just attack with the dragon. I'll be I mean, I only had to wait till the last turn of the duel to summon him. Yeah. Look, we did it. We did. I should unlock this challenge deck. Yay! Shall we just do it in the same video? Because this is most likely a very short video. Hmm. Probably. Yep, there it is. Alright. I didn't give you a fucking... Alright. All right. Time for duelist challenges. Don't we have to look for Pegasus? No, no, you wanted Seto. Okay, so... Wrath of Dragon, break out hot sauce. In this, you can only use your decks that you've built. I know. No story decks exist. I mean, you could use story decks, but you'd have to have some completed. Yeah, I don't. So we're gonna use hot sauce. Do a of prayer. Do a little prayer shimmy. Why do I keep getting Tyrant Dragon? Because he's your best card. Oh, yeah. Alrighty, dighty. Let's see what we're gonna do. We are going to summon the UFO Turtle in defense mode. Uh, that's our best bet because he has. Pl he's got. Uh, he's going to be using blue eyes. He's going to be using really powerful dragons that are over twenty five hundred attack. In combination with ancient, in combination with ancient rules, summoners arts. Dick card. But he only summoned one. If he had enough, he could summon more. And then he can trigger his effect. Hey, little Chimera, how you doing? Little Chimera or the Warm Worm? Mmm, I would definitely pick Chimera. Uh-oh. He already attacked. Oh, right, 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 right. Even if we start lo losing like crazy, we're getting cards. For obvious reasons. Yeah, please do. I'm gonna put down Trust Tornado. Uh, I am going to summon Flying Pegasus. Might as well get rid of his face, his his face down. Oh, right. If I tribute, then I lose Chimera. So, no. Let's summon Great Angus Boof. No matter what, one or all of your monsters are going down to. It could be Stone of White, or it could be Maiden of White. Or it could be a giant fluffy bunny! Okay, it was Flambell Guard. Wait, how did I defeat- Oh! Right. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. Uh, yes please. Dust Tornado. A goodbye called the haunted. Ow. Ow. Pretty much. Oh, you know what that does. No, it don't. If you attack it, he can summon another blue eyes. Haha, <laughs> I can special summon. Good luck. Yep. Two light monsters. Special summon in attacker defense. Um. Attack. Yeah, we can get to the maiden in white after we negate her effect. Yeah. Or, yeah, I would activate its effect and get rid of maiden's effect. Now what? What just happened? Wait, what? Can you, can you check our details, please? When this card is targeted for an attack, you can negate the attack, and if you do, change the position. 
Someone have blue eyes. But I didn't attack. I was negated. Exactly. You used its effect. Well, this sucks. No fooling. So I, in order to summon, I can't use the cards in my hands, can I? Nope. You have to use field monsters. Okay. Thank you for the uh, information. You are very helpful right now. I am Pegasus. Pegasus is twenty-three, right? Yeah, twenty-five. Uh, twenty-two. That's only five zero. Two two five zero. Okay, so that's nowhere near. No negating that attack. This is gonna hurt. Yeah, it's gonna hurt. I'm bracing for impact. Impact further braced. It's gonna. Oh, I thought it was gonna Ixie summon there. So, uh, I think hot sauce is really bad deck. It's only crappy because you don't have enough cards. A lot of good that does. This thing's dust tornado. Thanks a lot, dust tornado. Okay, so, um, Tom, brace for impact. Is there a way to skip the animations? Uh, you don't have a. They, animation only. Oh, dear. Uh, he's basically destroying your face down. No. You can't stop that. Like I said, you can't stop that. I'm gonna die. <laughs> you didn't attack with it? I mean, I know it only has 100 attack points, but yeah, it's it's over. Wait. You can't clear that 2,000 defense points or the 3,000 attack points. <laughs> Basically, I had a bad luck of the draw, right? Kinda, yeah. Ah, there's the Ixie summon. Why? Oh no, that's Synchro. Even better. Synchro summons, except for Okay, so I just. What, had a what cards do we get? We get okay, the Azure, that's good. Alright. Again. Azure would be much better if we had more blue eyes. I just want blue eyes. It's a good deck. You're a good deck. But it's always cut in half. Ew. Oh, okay, right, Yaki's good. Fisher. Terraforming. Much better shard than last time. Okay, so here's the plan. Get that field spell. Exactly. Activate its effect. Should I put the you don't want to don't want to set them. He's got the stomping attack, which will destroy face downs. What about Fissure? Fissure, you can risk set, but Regaki's got too much kick into it. So, so we've got 1,900 once, or we have whatever uh, Impachi has plus the field spell bonus. I think Impachi will have more attack points. Uh, this card gains for each spell counter it has on it, which would make it 1,900 plus whatever the field effect. Nope. No, he's not affected by the field effect. Only Blazing Impachi is. Okay, so let's summon the Impachi. And pray to whatever god we have. Um, start, pra start, start praying to Jaden Yuki. Fucker, have a 
enough cards back there. It can get worse. Don't tempt him. Summon another blaze in Apache. And then we go into battle mode. What was that you just destroyed? I don't know. Okay, that's good. I destroyed basically a tribute card. You basically destroyed a monster they could use to get a blue eyes out for one monster. You're welcome. Mm, what could he have there? Oh, hey, it's back. Oh, it's going away. Hi, blue eyes. Oh, go away. No one likes you. Can I get right back? Uh, yeah. But then, he has two other. Well, you can use Fisher, actually. Ah, oh, I do have Fisher, don't I? Say hello, Fisher. Alright. Some break. Alright, I'll summon the Windbreaker. This is, he, it's, for 300 attack points, he can uh, destroy one of the, the opponent's spell and traps. Should I use it? Uh, well, he's got two of them down. So, yes. So, yeah. Most of his spells he can't use without a dragon, but they're nasty if he gets to. That was called the Haunted. Yeah, we don't want Blue Eyes coming back next turn. Uh, brings back a friend. No. Okay. Rageki. Well, now we can go, go to main phase two, and then use Rageki. Sure, we should use Rageki now. It's only one blue eyes. Do you want to lose a monster next turn? No. Nuke him. Wonder why I didn't do that last turn. Oh hey, grab a dragon. Oh, it's so cute. Oh. Fudge. Swords of revealing life would be really nice right now, Yu-Gi-Oh. Well, he's got. I think he's got two light types out, but it won't help. Not even close. Yeah, you, it's game over. You can't survive. No, I have a plan. No, you literally... Did you forget what happened last match? Yes. I just want to die really hard. Well, you're going to get to now. Should I just surrender? I'm yes. I'm just gonna surrender. Yeah, yeah. No, wait, if I lose, I might get something. Well, if you'd still get something if you surrender. Oh, yeah. So, what have we learned today, children? You need to play more card games. Crack you. Do you want to help improve my fire deck? We can't- I don't have a whole lot to work with. Oh, God damn it. What? It's not even a- Can you hit Y on that? No, why? This is what this game is. Hell. Hi, children. How are you? It's been 3,000 years. And this might be a reason why I never actually- I'm sorry to understand why I don't really fully enjoy Yu-Gi-Oh right now. Because it's proving that if you have money, you win! Alright. We have some good stuff in here. Mm. We have a lizard. Aha! Uh, uh, 
I don't like that face down. You don't like that face down. I don't like that face down. Wait. Ha ha. That help. Oh, what card was that? Discard a dragon type and then draw two cards. So that was good, I attacked. Yeah, now we can attack him. With blackjack and hookers. Looks at watch. Yep, here it comes. Okay, it's a lesser of two weevils. So Weevil sucks. Well, now you can fish her. How do we win? We use 20,000 fissures. If only we, if only the max cap wasn't three. Oh boy. It's so cute. Do not attack that. But it's so cute. If you attack that, he'll bring Rabbit Dragon back. You know, attacking? Okay. This can help us. No. Uh, We're fucked. Call the haunted. It's not going to help us because we don't have monsters in there. He only have 1600 attack points because he only gets that effect when he's normal summoned. Oh. Never mind. And even then, if you attack the decoy dragon, the attack points will then be converted into blue eyes white dragon. Or rabbit dragon in this case. And you will destroy yourself. I have a plan. You have no defense points. Yeti. In my hand. Magic cylinder. How useful is that? Wait, actually, that might be useful. It'll stop one attack, but the monsters attacking are weak. Yes, but humor he me. is highly likely to summon out a thing. Humor me, decoy dragon. If it attacks us, no. No, we want him to summon into something strong. You can you can set call the haunted too. Okay. For what? Because if we can manage to survive, we can summon something and then sacrifice it for Sithonian Emperor Dragon. Uh, do you want me to activate the effect of call the haunted? Uh, not right now. We want to see what he actually does. No. no. We want to see him summon blue eyes. Just keep waiting. He's gonna destroy all the monsters in the field. That's fine. Wait for him to attack. I'm just wondering why he didn't use UFO Turtles effect. Oh, why? I was supposed to use UFO Turtles? He didn't. Oh, right, because he used that effect. So, do not. So, you. So, you. Well, you can't activate its effect now, because it didn't pick it when it was lit. So now we can activate Call the Haunted. Who do we haunt at calling? Turtle? Um, any of them. Doesn't matter. So I need the turtle, because then I have a chance of having something in my hand. Oh! Yep. It's still not strong enough, but we want to bait him into an attack. Are you sure it's not strong enough? No, it is not. Pretty sure. Okay, okay. 
Why are we baiting him into an attack, Tom? Explain your plan. Magic cylinder. Oh! You know that card I forgot we had? Oh. Really? Oh. He's attacking with blue eyes? Yep. Hit him with his best shot. Fifteen hundred. It's gonna come down to this. What's the plan? Damn it. Um. Hey, take a look at Sithonian soldier, please. The dragon we have. This one. Oh, this one. Yeah, he's got a secondary effect. What? I uh, can attack twice during the same battle phase. We can't just we can't destroy his blue eyes, sadly. But both his little side cards. We could, because the effect of Decoy Dragon... Why is it doing a, why is it doing a summon here? Oh, bec that's how you trigger his effect. You have to summon him again. Okay. Do you want me to do Otherwise, that? he's a normal. Yes, summon him again. So now, we can destroy his other dragon, because we have more attack points in him, and then we can direct the second attack with his face down. Okay, fifty. Okay. <sighs> Should I, can I summon another? No. Because I summoned Thankfully, we only lose one hundred for that, so we are in this game still. Yeah. We need something to take care of that blue eyes. It could have. What does your what does your wind dragon do? Gale dragon. Uh, flip one monster. Uh, flip. Target one monster in your opponent controls and return it to their hand. Set him. Set him. Okay. Now what? So oh, all we can do. So just add. Fix. Yep. So basically, when he attacks it, it will flip. Correct. Yeah. Buddy, I want you to return uh, your stupid blue eyes back. You need to actually pick his monster. Shut up. So now we need... okay. something strong to deal with potentially two thousand defense points. Flaming Apache, because the volcano effect. Gives him an extra 500. So we'll have plenty of attack, so it depends on what that face down is. That's not good. That's two blue eyes in his hands. Okay, okay, okay. Last. Just gotta last a little longer, right? Uh huh. What's the next card? Okay, it's Rabbit Dragon. Lesser of the two weevils. Evils. I like to imagine Thomas saying weevil. Wait. No. Okay. Not as much as in defense mode. Wait, I can summon that. Wait. Well, what's his effect? Don't summon it until we know what it does. If you have exactly three normal monsters in your graveyard, you can special summon this card from your hand by removing from play two normal monsters from your graveyard. Okay, and then he'll he'll have uh, 2,600 attack. I don't think that's high enough for Rabbit Dragon. Can I also normal summon a little Chimera? But, because it's a special summon, you can still summon... Little Chimera. Uh, yeah. See, you saw what I was going through. Okay, special summon, please. Um, gonna so get we need to remove two monsters. I would go with the two Apaches. Summon him and attack. And then, for a bonus, we add the teeny tiny chimera. Who gives us a whopping 
3100! Oh, uh, it's a shame we can't destroy your blue eyes, but I'll take a win. I'll take a bunny. We're just whittling his power now. Wait, should I attack him with a little- attack this thing with a little chimera? Uh, no, because he's bound to have a Flanvel guard face down, and you'll take that. Valid point. So even if he- if he just- let's see what he does. Dragon Shrine. Ugh! He has a blue eyes. Uh oh. Totem Speaking of blue eyes. Well, you can destroy a little Chimera. I'll It does. So now, now it's going to depend on what happens next. Basically, if it gives me a call to arms, that would be great. That'll work. What is it? That works! <laughs> Hi, Swords of Revealing Light. How are you doing? You doing great, buddy? I'd summon one of your lo lower scrub monsters. Uh, Firecracking so, it is. Beaver Kraken. Wonders why we call it call the Great Angus the Great Angus Beef. You've we've played enough times. They should know by now. Oh, made in what I can do. This is fine. This is fine. Now they have two. It's fine. Summon special summon Elector because they have two lightning monsters. We win. How are we gonna win? Use Elector special ability on the maiden. It's not gonna matter. Do it. The effect will trigger. The blue eyes will come out. And our effect is negated. Now what? Now we go to battle phase. Now attacker with attacker with a lector or your middle monster. Actually any of your monsters would work. Attack the maiden. You win. How Who cares? Did we, win this match? we killed an innocent woman. She deserved to die. She summoned a blue eyes. Valid point. Now you have that deck recipe for yourself. Do I have the cards for it though? No. <laughs> well, let's see what cards we get. Maybe. Maiden. Stamping. Stamping and Thunder and Dragon. And a bunch of deep. And some cash. You get a lot of you get a lot of cash when you win a challenge duel. So basically, the DP will be useful for. Um... We're going to buy cards. Buy set from Seto Kaiba. Also, that's one challenge deck down. One million. To complete the, <laughs> to complete that achievement. All right, should I just do buy not buy cards from the? I mean, you could because we need more blue eyes. Yeah. Do you want me to buy some Setos? Yes. <laughs> buy Setos. I mean, it's good, not what we're looking for, but it's good. <laughs> hey! Where do I have, like, 20 of yeah, these? You should, you should already have three of those by now. Uh, do you want to buy from him? Uh, yes. Those, those will start giving you some Generation 2 cards. Chain Strike. Oh, chain link number two. Yeah. Do you want me to keep buying from him or just go back to Seto? Yeah, keep going. Get a little we more. We need one more blue eyes. It'd be much easier to get more blue eyes from his easiest deck in reverse dual mode than it would be to get him from a booster pack. Why are we getting Ixie's cards from Trudge? Don't question the Ixies. I have so many questions. You have so Oh, by the way, we're still recording. Hi, universe! Um, we're gonna end this video now. Um, Tom, say something re Say something, uh... I'm not drinking Gatorade. Good. Uh, this video not sponsored by Gatorade, because Gatorade doesn't think we exist. Uh, thanks for watching, everybody. Goodbye. Gatorade, hit me up. Grape flavor is the best.